More details. Good morning. Okay, I've got my notes. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's check back in with Gwene. All right. Again, the challenge that she decided to undertake was to declutter a young lady's uh, bedroom, which unfortunately <laughs> can be the, the place where it's like the Bermuda Triangle. You try to go find stuff and you can't find it because it's all cluttered up. Okay. Gwene, you want to start with the closet? Yes, look what we've done here. Okay. Okay, we, um, oh, that's first so of all, much if you remember, there were so many different colored hangers. There was yeah. all kinds of different I items here. And so now we've done it not only in, by clothing in colored order, but with similar hangers. Yes. Really, the visual clutter makes such a, a, such a difference. And also, this is a way where we can tell what she has and what she doesn't have, because now we know she has a few too many white sweaters, a few too many black sweaters. We actually found two of the exact same pair of shoes Stop in the closet. It. So this is one of the, um, I'm not kidding. We did not, we did not stage this. We did not set this up. We actually found two totally exact same pair of shoes. So this, what did I say earlier about saving money? Yes. We also found a lone boot, which of course we don't know where that is. But what I did was we brought them in some, some the container store was generous enough to donate um, some, um, some items that would help us get organized. Oh, and so what yes. I did was get her two baskets, which um, she can now have her shoes in the baskets, which of course containerizes them. I love it. Um, but she can easier retrieve them. We talked about retrievability. And yeah. so now she can throw them in here easily, but get them back out. Okay. And it's much better than those kind of, you know, st um, shelving units. Yeah. Um, okay, let's pop so over, then to over the here. Floor. Yes. Yes. Okay, over here. I don't know if you remember, but she had this little. Um, hamper and it was on top and every time her daughter went to throw stuff over here it would land on top yeah. So what I said is let's get an open hamper so there she can go. literally just throw her clothes into it because otherwise it just piles up on top so we, we're getting her a new hamper again from the container store making it easy to use she had this she had this bin full of stuff. This is now a bin that's going to go away. When you're, okay. when you're organizing, you want to make sure to find what even doesn't belong in the room at all. And so this is all stuff that's now going, we discovered that was in her room, in a bin, that's going to another room. So this is going to go away. Okay. But instead, we did find some keepsakes. Oh. So I've nicely labeled it for her, Ellie's keepsakes. And I really encourage everybody to have a keepsakes bin for yeah. themselves, and then you can close it up, and we'll put it at the top of the closet, and then she can have her keepsakes. Um, every time she finds something, she can throw it right in there. Okay, Gwene, we're running um, out of time. I wanted to just real quick give your yeah. uh, tips for the drawers, because again, as you mentioned, she had a bunch of drawers, which was a great idea, underneath her bed, but she had yeah, one exactly. drawer that wasn't even being used. Yes. Yeah, so what I love doing is storing things closest to where you use them. So yeah. we're going to use this drawer for linens, and I even put a label here for linens. Oh, I love the, I and love then the we label. separated her stuff out. Dressed up clothes are here. Stuffed animals are here. Yes. And we purged a bunch of stuff that's now going to be donated as well because she was just overflowing. Done, so done, and I love that's it. That's what we did with her things. Gwene, you are yeah. awesome. Home Transitions, again, is her company. If you want to get in touch with her, because I know you got some decluttering to do in your house as well, you can contact her <laughs> via her website, uh, which we're going to link to ours, GoodDaySacramento.com, under show info and today's date for more details. I'm telling you, you need somebody to work the magic sometimes. It's awesome when it's done, but you need a little help to get started. Guys, back over to you. A little help. A little, little help. help. Yeah. She's great. She's great. I know, I've never seen you guys take notes like that. <laughs> 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 wow. Looks like there's going to be a quiz later.